Before we begin, please tap the subscribe button and the bell icon to get notified of the interesting videos we have for you every day. 1. A house is an asset. One thing you should know when planning to buy a house is that it isn't an investment. In some situations, it might turn out to be a liability, depending on how you purchase it. In reality, a house doesn't increase in value or generate money for you, except if the house is for renting purposes. Many banks have done a great job at creating lucrative deals for those who look forward to buying or building their own homes. The biggest lie society has told us is that having our own homes will free us from the monthly expenses of renting one. The truth is that in the long run, we'll have to put in cash to build and maintain the house. So, you can imagine how consuming it might get for someone who's paying the mortgage for the house he lives in. We have to be smart when making such financial decisions because, at the end of the day, we have to find a way to live comfortably and still channel enough money for investment without getting trapped in the debt bubble. 2. Soulmates The concept of soulmate originated from ancient Greek, where they believed that every individual is destined to have someone with whom they will be in perfect sync with. The story behind this came from a comedian who described humans as mutilated creatures with two heads, two hands, and two heads, before Zeus struck us into two halves, destined to find each other and live together forever. This folklore, however, failed to answer some pressing questions, like what if your soulmate finds someone else before you? Are you bound to live alone forever? Looking at it from this point of view poses many loopholes in the soulmate concept, weakening its credibility. So when searching for your life partner, please disregard this lie that society has fed us for years now. 3. The bigger the salary, the more successful you'll become. Society has led us to believe that a bigger paycheck guarantees us more success, but in reality it doesn't. Sometimes people who receive minimum wages turn out to become more successful than those who receive fat paychecks. Having enough to cater to your daily needs is fine, but tying your happiness to your bank balance is just absurd. Happiness cannot be bought, and having lots of cash in your account doesn't guarantee your happiness. Money comes with a lot of responsibility, and the more you have in your pocket, the greater the amount of responsibility. If you aren't careful, that thick pile of notes might cause more stress and health complications than the thought of having a plate of food on the table for yourself. At least now you're in the know and should think about reviewing some of the lies society has fed your minds. Or, looks don't matter. We've all heard this phrase at least once in our lives, and in a way, it's brought a bit of comfort into our lives to think that we can get away with looking frumpy and unkempt. I'm here to remind you that we are human beings. That means that we are 90% visual beings. We fall fast in love with what we see before we have tasted, felt, or experienced any secondary feelings. When was the last time someone's personality or kind heart, the first thing you noticed about them? You'll most probably like the color of someone's hair or maybe be marveled at someone's eye color. Especially when it comes to picking a romantic partner, looks become very important. The rest of the traits are things we learn about later on. You see, you should always ensure that you give appealing first impressions by accentuating your most outstanding features. And don't shy away from applying some makeup if you feel like being more adventurous with your looks. Also, never forget that even though looks aren't everything, they are still important. 5. Men shouldn't show emotion. And emotional men are weak. Men are viewed as the pillars of society and are expected to be brave at all times. Society has led us to believe that showing any signs of emotion is an indication of weakness. Do you agree with this hypothesis? In any instance that a man is seen crying or even trying to express his feelings, many people will condemn and even consider this man as a disgrace to society. This has led many men to bottle up their feelings inside, which might cause them great trouble in the future. Research proves that many men suffer from depression because of this so-called gender expectation. It should be clear to everyone by now that freedom of expression isn't limited to men, and they are also free to express their feelings in whatever way they feel comfortable. Relationships bear a symbiotic structure, and each team player is entitled to share their feelings. There's no such thing as the strong one in the relationship. Unless you're preparing for war, you can save up your strength for better things. 6. You can be whatever you want to be. The biggest lie fed to us is that we can be anything we want to be in life. The truth is that we can't be talented in everything, and we have to find our true purpose in life. If not, we should prepare ourselves to follow whichever way the wind blows us for the rest of our lives. And honestly speaking, do you believe you can be anything you want to be without focusing your time, money, and energy on it? Perfection takes a lifetime, hence impossible to be perfect in everything. 
You'll be able to do it, but your work will lack perfection. What you have to ask yourself is, what's the need of knowing everything if you aren't perfect at any of them? Thank you guys so much for watching. And before you go, please remember to subscribe to the channel right now and leave a like for that YouTube algorithm.